lot of unrest. In fact, this is a march through the streets uh, there earlier today. Now, L.A. police have arrested more than 2,700 people since the protest began. The city has been hit by lots of rioters, burning buildings, and much of the L.A. entertainment and music industries were silent today. They are taking part in the Blackout Tuesday Social Media Day in support of the Black Lives Matter movement. Meantime, President Trump visiting a second church in as many days as protests continue throughout the country. Protesters returned to city streets in the capital uh, despite a curfew. Demonstrators met the president and the first lady when they were visiting St. John Paul, the National Shrine. The presumptive Democratic nominee, Joe Biden, meantime, was in Philadelphia calling for police reform. The unrest in the city and across the country has many asking, will Las Vegas casinos continue with their plans to reopen this Thursday? Ron Futrell has been tracking down the answers. Good evening, Ron. Hi there, Kirsten. Yes, a lot has changed since a couple of weeks ago. They set that June 4th date for reopening Las Vegas casinos. At the time, the only concern was the fears of coronavirus and what that would bring. Now you have the added story of some of the protests that have turned violent here in town that have erupted. Security has also become a concern, certainly with the casino. Still, the casino officials we talked to today are sticking with their original times to reopen. The Bellagio plans to fire up their famous fountains Thursday at 9.15 in the morning, then open the doors to the casinos at 10. We have some really good security protocols that are in place. We are monitoring every single development that's going on right now, and with the protocols we have in place and the team that we have ready to go that, that's here with security, and I'm not going to get into details around what that's going to do with security, but, but I, I feel comfortable around where we're at. And from the Sahara Hotel, we have this statement, quote, our property is well secured, and in addition to having a strong working relationship with the Las Vegas Metropolitan Police Department, our security teams are well trained and used to managing large crowds often seen at our resort, end quote. Station Casino plans to open at 12.01 in the morning on Thursday. They're going to get right at it. South Point also opening Thursday, 8 o'clock in the morning. You can go online, 8newsnow.com, to see all of the times behind me you see when and on. Encore. Those casinos set to open Thursday, 10 o'clock in the morning. Now, we do have an update on what's going on with the county commission, and this is significant because they've just announced an emergency meeting to take place tomorrow morning, 9 a.m., at the county chambers, where they are going to discuss changing some of the rules associated with what you can bring to a protest. They are going to put an ordinance together or see if they can pass an ordinance that would prohibit bringing backpacks, large purses, luggage, stuff like that to protests. If you've seen some of the video, you can understand some of the reasons why on that. We'll keep you posted on that as it becomes available. Reporting live from near the strip, Ron Futrell, 8 News Now.